Data moves over, a run of 400 to the winning post and then one complete circuit of the track. Three-year-olds very strongly represented. Playful Princess a little fidgety but the gates open and they're off in the tankard. Rant and rave the West Aussie is about the first out. The Philly Dolchessa began well and so did Tristark and the Vagrant and Late Show. Handy Proverb is trapped out deep in the early part and even wider Tristram Rose and Playful Princess racing down to the judge on the first occasion and the Vagrant took up the running. The Vagrant led over Dolchessa, Tristark, Late Show, Tristram Rose three deep as they greet the judge the first time and then our Sophia Play Playful Princess, Rant and Rave easing back to be midfield. Handy Proverb, three and four deep, going out of the straight and then a bit like her. Further back came Lack of Reason, followed by Bone Crusher, Dwanet's Girl, Astralin, Fox Seal back at the tail of the field. And Samazan's about third last now as they start the run over the crossing at the 800, 1800 mark. And the Vagrant in front by a length and a half to Tristark. Dolce a third. Late show is close handy on the rails about fifth. Our Sophia, Tristram Rose can't get on the track. Between runners, Playful Princess on the fence. Rant and Rave. Handy Proverb pulling hard about midfield, followed by a bit like a three wide lack of reason. Then Dwanet's Girl and Bone Crusher, followed by Samazan and Astralin and Fox Seal dropped out to be last as they wielded their way into the back straight. 1300 left to go. And the leader is the Vagrant, a half length on Tristram Rose, who's had a hard run. Dolch has a third. Tristark fourth on the outside at the 1200 mark. Further back then is Al Sophia. Handy Proverb covering ground three deep on the outside of his stable mate. Late show. Lack of reason also covering a lot of extra territory and there goes a bit like a a bit like a one of the New Zealanders made a lightning move around the outside headed him off and raced to the lead now a bit like a shot to the front coming to the 800 mark by a length and a half to the vagrant in third place handy proverb followed closely by Tristram Rose Dolchezza and then Tristark and Late Show followed by Lack of Reason our Sophia further back in the field came Rant and Rave and then Dwanet's girl playful princess bone crusher a mile back Samazan followed by Astralin and Fox Seal as last as they near the corner. Coming around the bend at the 4.50 mark and Tristark had raced to the lead. Tristark leads the Tancred Stakes fields around the bend and straightened up in front of a bit like a followed by the Vagrant and then Dolchez a handy proverb behind them under pressure. Further back is our Sophia and Rant and Rave down the extreme outside at the 200 mark and a bit like her again beat off Tristark. A bit like her got clear of Tristark. The Philly Dolchez are trying hard to get to them. Rant and Rave, a look at Bone Crusher. Bone Crusher down the outside is coming home right over the top of them Rant and Rave and Bone Crusher Bone Crusher won the Tancred what a performance Bone Crusher beat Rant and Rave with a bit like a third close up Tristark uh, Dolchezza and Dwanet's girl handy proverb disappointing followed by our Sophia further back is Samasan. a gap then to Astralin playful princess late show the vagrant Fox Seal lack of reason and Tristram Rose last to finish in the Bowwater Scott Tancred stakes for 86 wow what a run Bone Crusher what a run he's come with a rattling run over the last hundred meters after being in front of no more than about two horses at the 800 he stood them up what looked to be an impossible start and this three-year-old by the former australian horse pagasa has put in a far lap run right down the middle of the track ridden by gm stewart who has a rather exuberant whip action bone crusher absolutely swamped rant and rave and a bit like her and has scored one of the best wins we've seen in a long, long time. Is this the bone crusher we saw in uh, Sydney as a two-year-old when his form was very, very disappointing? He went home to New Zealand and has made amazing improvement. One man who can't get over the improvement is jockey Ron Quinton, who rode bone crusher one day in a two-year-old race at Randwick and thought he was a very ordinary horse. Boy, he's more than ordinary now. Bone Crusher, Rant and Rave, so the three-year-olds have quinelled the Tancred Stakes.